all right boys what is up i am back with another video uh honestly um i haven't been uploading because i'm more focused on getting my license for the insurance adjuster that's my main priority right now but i'm still trying to bang out videos for you guys the videos might not be that good because i'm more focused on my insurance adjusting license like i said i'm trying to make some money out here i gotta get my priorities straight this is like my second thing i'm focusing more on but it's about like 11 a.m right now and i'm trying to make videos for you guys so if you guys like it make sure you guys subscribe and like but um oh yeah i created a discord server i spent like two hours on it it's still working in progress i'm gonna need some admins and some mods and uh <clears throat> i'll be looking forward to talking with you guys but yeah discord is up i'll put the link in the description if you guys want to uh join the discord server i'll be in there you know in and out talking to you guys learning about what you guys are going through what what kind of help you guys need you know we're trying to build a community a brotherhood but yeah are the discord servers up i'm still working in progress like i said i don't know much about discord so yeah but for today's video is why self improvement will get you more girls so i'm talking out of, i'm not talking out of my ass you know everything i talk about is from my experience and i'm not that old i would say to learn everything so as i go you know the experiences i go through uh i want to tell you guys you guys don't make the same mistakes as i did um i am 23 right now so i've i got my i'm not that old to get a lot of knowledge and wisdom you know but but this is what i've been through so before self-improvement you know i wasn't getting any bitches i wasn't even focused on girls to be honest and <clears throat> i would just play video games eat junk food watch movies all day and hang out with my friends i didn't even care about girls honestly but that was when i was like in high school yeah and then starting college i started to get care more about it and yeah but some of will get you girls because it makes you live up to your potential you know god gave us all this potential like i want you to think out of all these millions of guys you know <clears throat> imagine especially you if you're watching this imagine like what kind of golly genetics you have like sebum genetics you have that you don't know about because you haven't tapped into your potential you haven't gone to the gym for years and worked out imagine what kind of genetics you have like if you go to the gym for a year or two imagine what kind of genetics you have you're hiding under that all that muscle and you're gonna be aesthetic as fuck get all the bitches you know but most people don't even know about that because the gym community is a small niche. Self-improvement community is a very small niche too. And not a lot of guys know about what kind of godly genetics they have, you know. So it's kind of disappointing and unfortunate, but it is what it is. And and I heard a first man talking about this, like, so, like the straight seven system. I'm going to make another video about this to spread the message more from a young, young guy that's on self-improvement and you know self-improvement is going to be con continuous it's never gonna we're never going to reach to an end goal because we always have goals and ambition like i do you know to <clears throat> to see how far i can go you know there's going to be a point where where i'm like you know i'm competent i'm happy in life where i'm at and i'll i'll let off the gas a little bit but right now I want to, I have a lot of things to do. I'm young, so put in the grind years now and, and enjoy later. But back to the topic, that was just a side rant. <clears throat> so self improvement will get you more girls, you know. Honestly I I'm doing self improvement for girls and to make my life better because that was that's that's what motivates me. You know you see those <clears throat> TikTok girls, Instagram girls, like ten out of ten and I get fucking pissed off because I'm over here, 23, I'm not a millionaire. And I'm like, why can't it be me banging those chicks or being with those chicks, you know? Like, I should be there. I deserve it. I'm putting in the work so I can get girls at that capability. 
And it pisses me off because <clears throat> I know I'm going to get there one day. I want to get those chicks from Instagram models or TikTok girls that are like 10 out of 10s. And that's my fucking motivation. You might guys, th- you, guys, you guys might think it's like shallow or something, but that's my motivation. Everyone has their own motivation. You might have a different motivation. It could be like cars or a big house or something. But my motivation is girls, you know, that's what drives me. I want the highest quality girl I can get be rich, be financially free, and influence young people like you guys to become better for yourself too and for your community. Cause, oh shit, my mic came off my bed. <clears throat> Cause, you know, giving to the community, helping people out, that's the best thing you can do, honestly. You don't wanna do it for yourself, you wanna do it for others. Like, I want to give to the community when I'm rich and uh, build, like, a mosque in my in my hometown and build, like, a school, you know, stuff like that and donate to charity. But that's what makes humans happy is by helping others. Also, when you're on self-improvement, you respect yourself more. You don't, t- you don't take shit from anyone. Like, before, you know, I was very... Sorry, I can't, got the hiccups. Before, I was very agreeable. People, I would let people walk all over me. I was not like that nice guy. Like it was hard for me to say no when people would ask me for a favor. I'd be like, yeah, I'll do it, even though like I I would not want to do it. And self improvement helped me out with this because it made me respect myself more and ha- have high standards. Like I kind of became like a narcissist as as you could say i put myself first like if i don't get my shit done i'm not gonna help you out like i'll i'll be first back then like a year or two ago i even if i didn't have my shit done and i needed i needed to go do it uh i would just go help other people out because i was afraid to say no or i had because i didn't have any respect for myself i would eat junk food all day I would just go play video games. I would feel like shit. But now, like, <clears throat> I have high standards. If someone disrespects me, I, I call them out. This happened to me the other day at work. This uh, this guy, I work at a restaurant. So I told the guy, uh, you know, there's two two orders of this. And, and then he's like, okay. I, and then I come back, check on it. He's like, oh, you only told me one. He started, like, like yelling at me. You know, he didn't, say, he didn't say it in a nice way. He was, like, angry and mad. I'm like, look, I was like, look, if you're, if you're not gonna, I'm like, look, don't talk to me like that, don't raise your voice at me, uh, have some respect, and then, and then he didn't say anything, and then after I came back, he made it, and then he's very nice to me, so like, I, I call people out on shit, like, the way I don't want to be treated, I call them out, before I would never do that, I would be scared with altercations and confronting people, but now, it's like second nature, if, if I don't like something, or if someone do, does some something shady, just cut them off, you know. And that helps out with self improvement. It doesn't only help with girls, you know. It helps with everything, with friends, family, strangers. You can just check them right then, right then and there. They'll know that you're not like a, you're not someone to mess around with. So they'll they'll respect you more. That's what I've experienced. Like I give that example at work, and. Another thing I notice is when you build a good masculine frame, like big frame, people respect you more. They talk to you more nice. They're intimidated by you too. Like before, <clears throat> when I would, when I was working at the restaurant, like guys, older guys, they would like disrespect me and shit. And now that really happens to me. Even now when it does, I just check them like. Like, I'm not afraid, you know. I used to be afraid. I used to hope that altercations wouldn't happen. But now I, I'm like, you know what? I love being uncomfortable. Uncomfortable makes us better. Suffering makes us better. If I don't do this now, he's going to take advantage of me. And et cetera, et cetera. So that helped me a lot with self-improvement. It helps you out, like, in a business sense, work sense. Like I said, with friends and family. Everything, basically. So... I highly recommend you guys do self-improvement. If you guys are in a black pill, you know, man, 
I don't I don't know why you believe in that shit. It's all negative stuff. Instead of typing, uh, oh, like his face is like two thirds or like his eyelid shape is like fucked up. He won't get any girls. Go put in the work. Go put in the work for three, four, five years, and see, and see how you go. See, see what happens. Because instead of putting comments in people's YouTube videos, go use that energy and fucking go improve. Go talk to girls. Go make new friends. Uh, go read books. Go get your money up. This all all of this stuff will help you out. It makes you better. This is what part of life is. Level up, like Andrew Tate says, level up your uh video game character because like just treat it like a video game you know it's not that serious life you shouldn't take life that serious whatever happens it is what it is you know like yeah so so i highly recommend you guys get on self-improvement if you haven't already just start right now there's no perfect time i want you to start right now if you guys watched till this far um you guys are some real ones and i made a discord server the link is in the description uh you guys can join we're gonna have like-minded individuals i'll be in there to chatting with you guys getting to know you guys build i'm very happy that we're building this community uh yeah so let's let's see what happens with this youtube channel and i hope you guys enjoyed the video get on self-improvement and i'll see you guys next video peace